Hello everyone, you are welcome. Solve this nice exponential equation, which is 5 to power x times 25 to power x. This is equal to 80. So what is the value of x? Now let's prevent the solution from here. So we have 5 to power x times 25 to power x. This is equal to 80. The next step is that we can express 25 as 5 to power 2. So this implies, now this implies here we have 5 to power x times 25 which is 5 to power 2 raised to power x. This is equal to 80. The next step is that 5 to power 2 raised to power x, this is in the form of a to power n raised to power m, which we can express as a to power m raised to power n. So in this case here, we'll have 5 to power x times 5 to power x raised to power 2. This is equal to 80. So here we have 5 to power x times 5 to power x times 2. This is 2x. This is equal to 80. Now, from here, we have that this exponent equation is in the form of a to power n times a to power m, which we can express as a to power n plus m. Applying this exponent property, then we have 5 to power x plus 2x. This is equal to 80. So that now, here this is 5 to power x plus 2x. This is 3x, and this is equal to 80. Now, to solve for x from here, we introduce logarithm on both sides, so that here we have log 5 to power 3x, this is equal to log 80. You find that log 5 to power 3x, this is in the form of log a to power n, which we can express as n log a. Applying this power rule property, then here we have that rock 5 to power 3x becomes 3x rock 5. This is equal to rock 80. So the next step here is to divide both signs by rock 5 and also here by rock 5. So let's simplify here. Rock 5 and rock 5 simplifies so that 3x is equal to rock 80 divided by rog 5. The next step is that we can express 80 as 16 times 5. So let's substitute this. So we can express 80 as 16 times 5. So this means that we have 3x. This is equal to rog 16 times 5 divided by rog 5. The next step is that rock 16 times 5, this is in the form of rock A times B, which we can express as rock A plus rock B. Applying this logarithm property, then we have that 3x is equal to rock 16 divided by rock 5, then plus rock 5 divided by rock 5. So this implies here that rock 5 and rock 5 simplifies, so this is 1, so that here we have 3x is equal to 1 plus rock 16 over rock 5. The next step is that we can express 16 as 2 to power 4. So this therefore implies that here this is 3x which is equal to 1 plus rog 2 to the power of 4 divided by rog 5. The next step is that applying the power rule property here, that is rog a to power n, this is the same thing as n rog a. Applying this power rule property here, then we have 3x is equal to 1 plus rog 2 to power 4 becomes 4, rog 2, divided by 
فوق 5 the next step is that rock 2 divided by rock 5 this is in the form of rock a divided by rock b which we can express as rock a to base b let's apply this logarithm property so that here we have 3x this is equal to 1 plus 4 rock 2 to base 5 now the next step is to divide both signs by 3 so that now x is equal to 1 over 3 plus 4 over 3 this is rock 2 to base 5 the next step is that 1 over 3 is common here, so we can factor out 1 over 3 into the parentheses. This is 1 plus 4 rog 2 to base 5. Now, this is the value of x. This is the value of x. So the next step is to verify that this value of x satisfies the equation as follows. Now let's verify that the value of x, which is 1 over 3, into the parentheses 1 plus 4 or 2 to base 5 satisfies the equation. Now, if you recall from here, we have that 5 to power x times 25 to power x. This should give us a value of 80. Now, here we have 5 to power x times 25 is the same thing as 5 to power 2 raised to power x. This should give us a value of 80. So this is the same thing as 5 to power x times 5 to power 2 times x. This is 2x. This should give us a value of 80. The next step is that 5 to power x times 5 to power 2x. This is in the form of a to power n times a to power m, which we can express as a to power n plus m. So this implies that here we have 5 to power x plus 2x. This is supposed to give us a value of 80. So this implies that we have 5 to power x plus 2x. This is 3x. This is supposed to give us a value of 80. So the next step is to substitute the value of x as follows. Now substituting the value of x here, this means that we have 5 to power 3 times x, x is added into the parentheses, this is 1 plus 4 rog 2 to base 5, this is supposed to give us a value of 80. So this implies that here we simplify 3 by 3, so that here we have 5 to power 1 plus 4 rog 2 to base 5, this is supposed to give us a value of 80. Now, we find that 5 to power 1 plus 4 rock 2 to base 5. This can also be expressed as 5 to power 1 plus 4 is the power. So we can express this as rock 2 to power 4. And then to base 5, this is supposed to give us a value of 80. Now, 5 to power 1 plus rock 2 to power 4 to base 5. This is in the form of a to power n plus m, which we can express as a to power n times a to power m. Applying this exponent property, this implies that this is the same thing as 5 to power 1 times 5 to power rog 2 to power 4 to base 5. This is supposed to give us a value of 80. The next step is that 5 to power rock 2 to power 4 to base 5, this is in the form of m to power rock a to base m, which essentially is equal to a. Now, applying this logarithm property, then we have... Now, applying this logarithm property, then 5 to power rock 2 to power 4 to base 5, this is equal to 2 to power 4 which is equal to 16. So let's substitute this. Here we have 5 times 
16. This is 5 times 16. This is supposed to give us a value of 80. So 16 times 5, this is 80, which is equal to 80. So this means that the left add side is equal to the right add side. The left hand side is equal to the right hand side. And this implies that the value of x, which is 1 over 3, into the parentheses, 1 plus 4, rock 2 to base 5, satisfies the equation. So kindly follow the steps, like this video, and subscribe. Kindly like and subscribe. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.